want to show you what happens to your remote when you corrupt the files from unplugging it without safely removing it from your hardware. You won't get your categories. You'll have a sound list on here. Other than that, you don't get your categories. What I want to do now is walk you through the process of how to fix the corrupted files on your TX-1000. The first thing you're going to want to do is get your Fox Pro programmer opened up on your screen on your computer. Then the next thing you're going to do is plug in your cord to your TX-1000 and go ahead and turn it on. And you can just ignore that message down here. You can ignore this message here right now. What you're going to want to do is go over here on your left hand side. Open this window and find your file explorer and click on that. And then what you're going to do is scroll down here. You're looking on the left hand side in your D drive, E drive, F drive, wherever, whatever it shows up on this letter. You're looking for that TX-1000. So now what you're going to do, you're not going to open it up. You're just going to right click on it and you're going to see format. And when you see this format, take and click on format and then go down here and click on start. And then you're going to get this warning that comes up and go ahead and say OK. It says formats complete. So you can hit OK and go out of that and out of here. And then it says, do you wish to update the remote file category list? So then you would say yes. And it's complete. So again, you can hit OK, but do not go out till you go down here and find where you safely remove the hardware. And so right there it says a TX-1000, so I hit on that. And you can see now it says it's safe to remove. The message that was on your screen on your TX-1000 clears, and you now see everything preset on there correct like it should be. And then you can go ahead and unplug it. And that's all there is to it. Well, it sounds easy enough, doesn't it? Actually, it really is pretty easy to do, but boy, if this happens to you on a weekend when Fox Pro is closed or the night before you're headed out on a hunt, if you're trying to update your collar, boy, it can be a nightmare. Please share and like this video, and if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please subscribe now.